What's good YouTube, ABQ Arsenal here. I wanted to make this video for anyone wondering how to install a pistol brace. I'm not actually gonna be doing it in the video. As you can see, I already got mine on there, but I'm gonna walk you guys through it the best as I can. But let's get into the video. I just wanna start off by saying if you could hit that like button, subscribe button, comment down below, it would really help the channel. But let's get into the video. So, and first you're gonna wanna separate your upper from your lower, which I've already done here. So just go ahead and put your upper to the side. You're going to want to come inside of here. You're going to see this little pin right here. You're going to want to hold that pin down. That releases the spring that's inside of here. Take that spring out, put it to the side. It's pretty simple. Then you're going to want to come and get a castle nut wrench. You're going to want to loosen your castle nut. You want to be very careful doing this. There's going to be a spring right behind here that will come flying out. So you're going to kind of want to put your finger over it so that spring does not come flying out. But as you loosen that, then you're able to screw this off, your uh, buffer tube, um, your old stock or whatever you have on there. So just screw it off like normal. Then you're going to want to uh, put your castle nut and this piece on your new buffer tube that has your pistol brace on it. Um, then just screw it on like you did, uh, like you screwed it off before. Then you're going to want to uh, put the spring back in there. Um, I would suggest kind of holding the spring and then pushing this over it and then tightening your castle nut just so you don't bend the spring that you have in there. So make sure you put your spring back in there, tighten your castle nut. Um, then you're going to want to come back in here, push this down again, then just go ahead and slide your spring back in and then you should be good to go. I would just make sure your castle nut is tight enough and you can also pin it there's these little notches in there so you get like a it's kind of like a little metal like thick needle kind of thing but you kind of do it and hammer it into there so your castle nut doesn't come loose um but that's about it it is pretty simple to do um i did have some trouble doing it i mean i do try to learn as much as i can on my firearms but yeah it's pretty simple I'm going to try to get a stand so I can make some better videos for you guys, better content, and actually show you guys how to do installations and all that. But thank you guys for watching, and see you guys next time.